We have new details tonight about the arrest of the dean at a Marion County High School. He's accused of molesting a teen, and investigators are concerned there could be some more victims out there. It happened at Lake Weir Middle School. News 6's Treasure Roberts is looking into the investigation. The middle school dean is accused of sexual battery. Deputies say he assaulted a juvenile late Wednesday night here on school property. A Lake Weir Middle School staff member is now in Marion County Jail after a student accused him of assaulting her. 40 year old Henry Anderson is a dean at the middle school and also the varsity track and field coach at the high school. He's being charged with sexual battery. Deputies say the victim is between 12 and 18 years old. Anderson is her track coach. She told deputies Anderson usually takes track team members to a gym in Ocala to work out after practice. The victim says Wednesday she asked Anderson if she could join. The arrest report shows he originally told her no. Later that night, she says Anderson changed his mind and picked her up. She told detectives he had her lay on a table, then began massaging her legs, which she says he's done before to help soothe her body pain. The victim says he took off her shorts and started touching her private areas. She says she started crying, but told him she was okay out of fear. When Anderson walked away briefly, she got up and put her shorts back on. She says he came back and suggested they finish the massage, but she said no and they left. After stopping for food, he dropped her off at home around 1.30 the next morning. During questioning, Anderson told investigators he had a good relationship with the victim and her mom. When they got to the school, he says the victim did multiple exercises, also saying he was in and out of the room and didn't have much interaction with her. He told detectives she took her pants off because she was hot and denied ever touching her. When asked why she would make this up, he said she was upset with him and threatened his job previously also insinuating she was, quote, promiscuous. Investigators determined his statements were contradictory. Marion County Public School says Anderson passed all background checks before hire. He's currently on paid administrative leave pending the outcome of the investigation and isn't allowed on property. The sheriff's office is urging anyone who has been victimized by Anderson to please come forward. In Marion County, Treasure Roberts getting results, New 6.